I punch people in their face. I punch niggas in their face. I got you a chocolate bar, man. That was the weakest, wackiest freestyle ever. And then he got knocked out. <laughs> <laughs> and his homeboy crying. At first I thought it was the same dude. But that dude was knocked out. He couldn't talk no more. They were carrying him. And then as soon as he got hit, the dude was like, Okay, hold, calm down, calm down. I've seen this before. I know what to do. <laughs> I've been in this situation before. I know how to handle it. Man, that was hilarious, man. They had me rolling. So, anyway, Reggie Bush time. Reggie Bush time. Let's talk about why he's in the news now. Why in the news, MC? Uh, basically, he took money and gifts while he was in college, which technically makes him ineligible. So, USC lost... A championship. Mm -hmm, and he loses his Heisman Trophy because of it. So he's and the, a championship. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, he's the first person to ever get his Heisman strip. Not the way you want to go in the record books. Exactly. How long ago was this that he got it? It's been four years, four or five years. Five, six. So it was a five-year investigation, and now they're... I, I wanna, that's what I wanted to know. How did it even come out? Let's check out the video and see what was said. Yeah, okay. That was a great video, man. <laughs> that was sweet. Did you see a video? Yeah. Uh, you know, I got that. Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> Wait, make myself move with my eyes. <laughs> All right, well, anyway, apparently. Uh, we don't have a video. Yeah. <laughs> my the engineer. My bad. The engineer screwed that up. Whoever that is. <laughs> So, anyway, um, you read the article, MC? Mm -hmm. Okay, you got the floor, man. Tell us why. It's How did it come up? That's what we want to know. It had been suspected for a while, and for mm -hmm. some reason they targeted uh, USC because they thought uh, Pete, Gar Pete Carroll was going to get caught up in it too. But somehow he got out of it, so they lost their championship, like scholarships, mm -hmm. uh just pretty much everything to do with that year pretty much it didn't even happen for USC. They, they lost scholarships? Mm -hmm. I mean, how does that work? If I mean, all this stuff is already passed. You know? Right. So... That's the way they're working it. They're changing the records. Oh, they're changing the records. Because you can't take money back. No, no, no. Not, no, like it's a way of, punish, of punishing the school. So oh, like yeah, 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 yeah. Like UNLV. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, yeah, clarify that. Clarify that. So, scholarships. Other people coming in. Other people coming in, they can say, well, we're going to take away those athletic scholarships we're going to give to your football team or something to that effect for mm -hmm. the next two years or whatever. So, the so school then loses money. For, okay, so this was, what, four or five years ago that he, he was given the Heisman Trophy. So what happens now, like... He when has, people look back and it's like so on this this year, who you know who was given the Heisman Trophy? Nobody. Obviously they're gonna pull that out, but is anybody like? Are they gonna go back? No. Nope. That's it. That's the end of the story. Just nobody. It was given and it was stripped and that was that. Yeah, nobody gets it. It's like it never even happened. Just like with the championship, probably right. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna no, 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 be like yeah, in the think, books. I think because so. they were talking about they should give it to the next of uh, next right. team. With the best record, or I guess, would have been uh, Oklahoma. They, whoever they played, whoever was USC beat. UT? Florida, UT. Was it UT? Was that was the year they beat UT? It was no. a different year. Because I was because they were saying they weren't going to give it to UT, so it must have been. I don't know. I would have to look it up. But I, it, was, it wasn't UT. It was like Oklahoma or something. Because he was playing for uh, California, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, Is he going to so be penalized like, besides... 
Uh, I don't think so. But doesn't everybody know you can't take money from the school and gifts? I didn't even play football or any sports, and I know that. (laughs) Everybody knows it, but there's kind of ways around it, like, we didn't give it to you. We gave it to your mom's cousin. And right. we're going to give your brother a job here and pay him $50,000 a year to... To take care of you. Yeah. So, so you don't have to work. So you there's ways playing. around it because a lot of these guys are doing it. He just happened to be the one that got caught. I mean, and I mean, so I'm saying they should be paying these guys anyway, man. Well, I mean, I know that's the difference between... You know, being uh, in college, an amateur, versus being a professional. And that's the problem that I have. It's such that great line, you know, it's very, it's very challenging. And these guys, man, they bring so much revenue to the school. Yeah. They bring so much revenue to so the school. So look what the school does for them. The school gives them exposure. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Gives and them a chance to play. So they, they get... They receive from the school also. Yeah, of course. Agreed. It's a it's a mutual win win situation. It can be. Right. But you can't eat off some of that stuff that the school gives them. And you can't eat if you have some money to go buy some food. But the um football team provides that. Oh the football team provides their meals. Yeah, but they don't provide them with a car on the weekend, dinner yeah. dinner you know, food for their families at their house. A car on the weekend does not affect their grades and their ability to play football. That's a luxury. There's a lot of college students that don't have a car on the weekend. And I feel sorry for those So guys. because you play football, the school's supposed to provide it? I mean, I'm not saying that the school should. I'm saying that I feel like there should be some level of compensation for They're these. They're getting an education. They're getting scholarships, they for books, a- food. They get travel. They have to do their own homework to get that education, though. <laughs> and what's wrong with that? I not paying for it. I have to do my own homework, but I have to pay for it. Oh, okay. I got student loans to pay back. Oh, they don't. Okay. okay, okay. That's true. Is this it? Yeah, this is it right here. I mean, uh, let me, hold on a second. I was going to pull up so y'all could take a look at the Heisman. How many of y'all have ever seen a Heisman? That's it right there. The infamous stiff arm. <laughs> he knew he was doing wrong. He didn't have to accept it. So I don't feel bad for him for getting it taken away. I mean, it's, it's, it's a touchy He's situation. not getting penalized. He's not paying any type of fine. All he is is getting stripped from the title. Does it suck? Yeah, but like Portia says, he should have known better. I mean, I know it's a big deal have, being the Heisman Trophy. It's a big deal. I don't know. Five years down the road, is it a big deal to him now? All right, the Heisman Trophy went because he already got the, five years ago. But. Right, because he already got the paycheck, you know, being drafted in the top two for because he was a Heisman. Right. right. It's not like he got it and then the next day they stripped it from him. That would have probably been more, maybe more traumatic than five years later. But mm-hmm. you knew you were doing wrong the whole time. You were accepting those things, gifts, money. So I, I don't. <laughs> I don't feel anything for him about it. What do you think, MC? I think they should give it to the next person in line. You don't think it's just, it should be vacant? <laughs> yeah, it's like the whole year never happened. There's no champion. There's no Heisman Trophy winner. Somebody came in second place. Right. Because the first yeah. the first place person cheated, basically. Right. So, yeah, right. I agree with that. They were trying to make an analogy of how the Heisman Award is pretty much just the sports version of a, of a beauty pageant. A popularity contest. Mm-hmm. Like it's voted on by a thousand people who aren't necessarily experts in college football. But right. That's how it's chosen. So treat it like a beauty pageant. <laughs> <laughs> and give it to the next, the runner-up, huh? Because okay. that's what they do in the uh, beauty pageant contest. Well, yeah. 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 Yes, your former title is second runner-up. Oh my bad. Oh, well, I mean, you know, wrong is wrong. He did wrong. He, he did, did wrong. The school did wrong. Yeah. Well, if they knew about it, right? Yeah, they knew. I <laughs> don't think the school, they knew. They knew. And plus, I heard one of his gifts was like some, 
Yeah, one of his gifts was some tricked out car. I don't know what it was, but yeah. it was something that he obviously didn't buy himself. Man, that's so common too. Mm-hmm. Cars are so common. Other people have an easy way of providing, you know, this person with a car. So they always offer an act. I mean, it's something tangible, something you can use right away, something that makes you look like a star. A car is so common, man. It's a shame. And that's a, I mean, it's like, of course that's going to bring attention. Right. Right. I mean, but they weren't even. They may have been discreet about the way they were saying they were doing it, but when you give big flashy gifts like that, that's gonna bring attention. Yeah. Nine minutes. All right. We said. All right. I'm gonna try one more time, y'all. It's, it, says, it says a minute is a minute and, and forty seconds. So let us see one more time. If we can't get it to play, if we can't. So. Get to give them some time to. Bond with it before they have to give it back. What happened was I moved. It's packed away in storage somewhere. (laughs) Well, maybe he could say, "Well, I don't have possession of it because I gave it to this person. Gave it to this person." Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. The story of the traveling high school. Right. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. All right. Well, we're going to go into the next segment, which is going to be, uh, oh, the Texans. What time is it? Ten minutes. Oh, 10 o'clock. Uh, yeah. yeah, let me 